everybody. I'm Dr. Vipul Agrawal. I'm a urologist from Columbia Asia Hospital, Padam Bihar, Gurgaon. Urology is, is the branch which I deal with, which deals with all your kidney and urine related issues, whether it is from kidney, from the tubes called ureter, bladder, prostate, which is only in males, testes, penis, <coughs> and even urine infection, which is much more common in females. Now, first of all, the most common thing that we come across is stones. Stones is a very common problem in India and we at Columbia Asia have been regularly doing stones of all sizes and all locations. Uh, stone can happen to anybody and the surgeries that we are doing over here are quite advanced and almost latest and up to date with international status. Usually the patient does not require any cut or incision. At the max a small cut with just one stitch. The patient is usually discharged in 24 to 48 hours. No bed rest is required and the person usually resumes his office or day-to-day -day activities within 24 to 48 hours. It is very common, it is very easily treated, there is nothing to be scared of and if you ask me what is the usual treatment that depends on the stone. It's like asking me how much a car will cost or a car can cost like anything so similarly the stone treatment can be anything depending on where it is and how big it is. Yes and all stones do not require surgery, some stones can be just left as such under observation or given a trial of medicines. The second most thing that we come across is prostate. Prostate enlargement is something like aging. If you continue to age, you will continue to develop prostate. So it's not like some medicine, some therapy, some physical maneuver can avoid developing prostate. If you are growing older, you will have growing of hairs. <coughs> Excuse me. Similarly, you will have prostate enlargement. Prostate enlargement usually presents as problems in passing of urine which may be from like frequent passing of urine or even inability to pass urine. At Columbia Asia we are doing all the advanced prostate related surgeries for all age groups right from 45 years to 110 years of age and across all sizes of prostate right from 15 grams if required to up to 150 or even 250 grams of prostate. Prostate, a lot of people say should be should it be operated because the patient is quite old, but because the illness is of old age, so the treatments designed worldwide are which are safe for those people. So prostate surgery is very safe. Usually the patient is up and about within 24 hours and can resume his normal duties within 48 at the max 72 hours. There is no cut, no incision, it is totally an endoscopic technique which is very safe and very effective and as of now the gold standard for it. Now the third most common problem that comes to this is cancers. Cancers can occur from any part of the body right from kidney to you know, bladder, prostate, testes or penis. We have been regularly operating patients for any of these surgeries with advanced treatment options available to the patient and the patient have been quite happy and following up with these things. So I can definitely say you in case, in God forbid, if you have any of these cancer related issues pertaining to the organs that I deal with, you are always welcome to get any forms of treatment over here. Now the next thing which is quite common but very uh, less commonly mentioned because of the embarrassment is male infertility which comes scientifically under the term of andrology. Andrology is <coughs> regularly being treated over here. We have uh, very advanced uh, investigations like ultrasounds and dopplers to treat medicines, surgeries, whatever are required and the patients are coming regularly being treated regularly. A very frequent problem of patients is they have stones in both the kidneys. Now treating both stones of stones of both the kidneys simultaneously is not something like you go by the line key. I'll definitely treat both the sides simultaneously or I will not touch both sides together. This all depends on the patient the patient's stone load and how much of kidney is being injured. Sometimes what you might do is if the stones are really good and nice, whether it's easy for you to manage, you can do the both the stones in the same setting. Sometimes you might not. Or sometimes you feel that both kidneys are at risk, then you remove or clear the stones on one side and do some minor procedure which will save the kidney on the other side till the time you bring the patient again for the second surgery. So it's not likely, yes, all stones can be treated, all both kidney stones can be treated in one go and it's not also like no you cannot touch both kidneys together. Both can be done depending on the patient, the stone root and the kidney being injured.